Hello everyone. So I'm here to show you uh, my new smart coffee table. It's from a company called Sobro. I bought it on Best Buy for sale. It was around a thousand dollars, I think, um, here in Canada. So I just wanted to give you a quick review of this uh, pretty fancy, uh, interesting table here. So first of all, I wanted to show what how it looks like. Um, there's two colors, I believe. This is a black one, and there's a white one as well. That's the company right there, Sobro. This is uh, basically a pretty fancy table. I'll show you the main features right now. Uh, as you can see, first of all, you have in this table, you have a couple uh, USB ports here, so you can plug in your cell phone or whatever electronics you want. There's two of those. Then you have also here, let me show you. You have four plugs in total. So you have two here and you got two on the other side. Same idea, you just take that cover out. Now, this right here, this is a two speaker. So this is also a speaker unit where you can uh, connect your, there's two of those, two speakers. Uh, this might look like uh, some type of bass or surround sound, but it's not. It's just, uh, that's just how it is. It's the model of the, of the table. The finish looks pretty nice. Kind of looks like a speaker, but it's not. Those are the two speakers on the side. And it sounds really, really nice. You can hook up your, your Bluetooth, whatever you want. It's very easy. As you can see, here's the controls. Never mind the, the finger smudges here. I wanted to leave that out there because this glass here is very nice. You can easily clean it, but is um as you can see it's a finger fingerprint magnet so be aware of that you might have to clean it especially if we have kids i have a small kid here running around so she's always touching the table and this is what you see here all those fingers that's why i didn't clean it before doing this review i just wanted to show you how how it kind of it is but it's very easy to clean just like a glass table. Okay, so now what else? Uh, I'm gonna show you here the controls. It's pretty simple. So see the Bluetooth sign here? This Bluetooth right here. That means it's ready to pair with any anything that, any device that you have. So it's very easy. You grab your, your cell phone, you open your Bluetooth and you pair it with the table. It will show up as a Sobro. And then you're ready to play your music from there, from any device that you want that has a Bluetooth connection. And the speakers are very, very loud. I don't have right now, I don't have it set up right now. So if you, if you really want to hear the sound, let me know in the comments. I can make another video. But uh, it's very, it's very, very loud. So it's pretty nice speaker system. As you can see here, this is a, let me see here. This is to lock the buttons right here. So once it's locked, nobody can touch. Even if you press, nothing happens. So you have to unlock it. You have something else like, um, I'm gonna show you here, the slides too. So let's turn on the lights. There you go. There's some lights in the bottom here. And there's many different colors. So let me see if I can change it. There we go, see? So you, once you press the light bulb right here to turn it on, you press this arrow right here and you switch between colors. Very cool, really. It's very, it's mostly visible in the dark, so during the day it's not much uh, visible, but yeah. So yeah, so if you wanna turn it off, you press it again, it's off. The other control is the volume for the Bluetooth, which you, you can also control it from your phone. So you can just have this at max if you want. 
and just control it from your phone. It's way easier. Then this is um, this is to change the time. And this is also to switch between, you can also pair this to your TV. If your TV is an older type of TV that doesn't have a Bluetooth connection, it comes with, uh, let me show you first, two drawers right here. You can keep your stuff here, your controllers, whatever. Two small drawers, very nice. <clears throat> and the coolest thing here is this. It's a little fridge. You can fit a, a bunch of stuff here. As you can see, I have a few beers, water, and you can fit way more than that. You can fill it up, and it's very nice. It's very nice and cool. And it's not loud at all. I can't. You can't really even hear the the fridge. It's a, it's it's. This is the coolest part because you know you you're just sitting here on your couch. And you can just grab your drinks from there. It's pretty cool. So yeah, so this is I think the. And what I was telling you before about the TV is uh, it comes with also comes with this dongle. That you will connect this comes with the cables as well. You connect this to to your TV. Uh, through the AV, audio video cable. And then this, you can hook it up to the table so you can hear the audio from the TV on the table. If that's something that you want. I don't, I don't have it hooked on because I don't really need the TV coming through the speakers. But if that's something that you want, you can do that. And they provide you with this. If, uh, if your TV is, doesn't have Bluetooth connection. If it does, you can just connect it straight to the, to the table. And yeah, so basically, uh, this is a wire here. So what I did is uh, if you're planning on putting a, a carpet in the bottom, which I'll probably recommend doing because if you don't have a carpet, you'll have the wire showing because you're gonna have to plug it in somewhere, right? So I have a plug in the back of the couch here. So what I did is I put the, the carpet, I bought a carpet here and I made a little hole just showing you here I can I made a little hole here and I pass the wire to through the bottom of the carpet and I plug it in in the wall here it's in the back there right there it's a long cable so so even if uh, you don't have to be really really close to the to the plug it's pretty it's, it's a very long cable so they give you a very long cable to play with so if you don't want a carpet, you can just, if you're putting this table right beside a plug, then you don't have to get a carpet. But if you're having something similar to what I have, then it's good to have a carpet and you do, you put a hole in it, run it through, and then is you won't see the cable anymore. So yeah, so I just wanted to show you this table. It's pretty cool table. It's, it's kind of expensive for, for the, for the, let me put this down. Put this back hold on yeah so it's easy to put in if it's if it's um uh, if you don't want to spend a thousand dollars i don't know how much it is maybe in the u.s or somewhere somewhere else but here in canada that's what it cost me a thousand dollars on sale so it's even more expensive um it's still quite expensive for a coffee table but i think it's cool and i like all this uh geeky stuff so for me, it's something that I wanted to get. And if it's something that you don't care about, you don't want speakers, you don't care about the plugs, you don't care about the fridge and your table, then you don't need this table. But if it's something that you think that you might use, you might find useful, then I think it's pretty cool. If you don't mind spending that much money, it's really cool. Like every time people come over, they'll just... Uh, They'll always talk about this table, trust me. Everybody's obsessed with it. Yeah, so I just wanted to give you that review. If you have any questions, if you're planning on buying this, let me know, I will answer you as soon as I can. Also, if you want to hear the test, the sound quality of the speakers, let me know and I can try to make a video of that. But just 
take our word for it. It's not. It's not maybe like don't don't expect to to have a, like a Sony Bluetooth speaker quality, but uh, it's pretty good. It's pretty good for up if you're planning to have a party or whatever. Turn it on, put it full full volume, and it's loud enough, very loud. So yeah, so this is my my quick review of this. I had this for a few weeks, haven't had any problems. It's also a one year warranty, which uh, if anything has if any problems with the fridge or or anything else, you get a there's a number that this you get in the box. There's a number that you can call and they'll they'll arrange the how to fix it. But no problem so far, working well. So any questions, guys, let me know. I'll try to answer them. And yeah, take care.